Merry Christmas! And finally, I'm doing a legit Christmas-themed film. No bullshitting this time. So what am I going to talk about today? Well, most really bad Christmas movies have already gotten a spotlight. Hold on, what's this here? A short from 1975 called A Christmas Tree? Generic title, but let's see what this has to offer. What the hell? Hold up, are we gonna see these trees get murdered? Oh, thank God. That tree has tits. What? 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 What is this? This has got to be the most unintentionally creepy thing I've ever seen. The short is obviously meant to be a day in the life of a Christmas tree. But why is it shot like a horror movie? This has the same eeriness as Last House on the Left. Did no one look at this and say, yeah, this is too freaky. I should not be getting fun in Balloon Land vibes from this. Well, to be fair, this is a much more competent film than Balloon Land, and it's less creepy than that one. I have a feeling this was meant to have a stage production feel about it, like a pantomime or something, which is appropriate seeing as the actor who plays our main tree, Julian Chagrin, appeared in Shelley Duvall's Fairy Tale Theater. This has some things going for it. As I said, the pantomime aspect of it would work if it wasn't shot so creepily. But for the most part, this is just a big ball of what the hell were they thinking? And this guy looks like Robert De Niro. I'm just saying. Well, that was my first foray into a Christmas-themed movie. Was it worth it? Yes! This movie is so insane, you have to go and watch it. Seriously. You can find it on Rift Tracks, as it's the short before their main feature, Santa's Christmas Circus, starring Wizzo the Clown. I'm the Cinema Fanatic, and I'll see you next time.